first having read the book on it, below the camera, and check the edge on my blade. I put on the body armor of black rubber, absurd slippers, a grave and awkward mask. Having to do this, not like you stole with his fastidious team aboard the sun called the schooner, but here, alone. There is a ladder. The ladder is always there, hanging innocently close to the side of the schooner. We know what it is for. We who have used it. Otherwise, it's a piece of a maritime class, some sundry equipment. I go down, rung after rung, and still the oxygen immerses me. The blue light, the clear atoms of a human ear. I go down. My flippers cripple me. I crawl like an instant down the ladder. And there is no one to tell me when the ocean will begin. First there is blue, and then it's bluer, and then green, and then black. I'm blacking out, and yet my mask is powerful. It pumps my blood with power. This is another story. This is not a question of power. I have to learn alone to turn my body without force into the deep element. And now, it is easy to forget what I came for. Among so many who have always lived here, Swaying the crenellated fan between the reefs, and besides, you breathe differently down here. I came to explore the wreck. The words are purposes. The words are maps. I came to see the damage that was done and the treasures that prevail. I struck the beam of my lamp slowly along the flank of something more permanent than fish or weed. The thing I came for. The wreck, and not the story of the wreck. The thing itself, and not the myth. The drowned face always staring toward the sun. The evidence of damage, worn by salt and sway into this threadbare beauty. The ribs of the disaster, curving their assertion among the tentative hunters. This is the place. And I am here, the mermaid whose dark hair streams black, the merman in his armored body, we circle silently about the wreck. We dive into the hold. I am she, I am he, whose drowned face leaves with open eyes, whose breast still bears the stress, whose silver, copper, vermile, cargo lies, whose curly side barrels, half wedged, and left to rot. We are the half-destroyed instruments that once the held to our course, the water-eaten log, the fault compass. We are, I am, you are, by courage or courage, the ones who find their way back to the sea, carrying a knife, a camera, a book of myths, in which our names do not appear. <laughs>